What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to talk about something that's a little bit heavy. It's about 30 pounds overall and it's this. Ugh. These are the Power Up Dumbbells from Life Pro. Alright guys, so Life Pro did send it over to me this Power Up Dumbbells, but we had no pregnant whether I should do a positive negative review. It's my own thoughts on these products. And yeah, these are the dumbbells. These are something that I was really interested in. I think it's really important right now, especially because some people are going back to the gym. I've been going back to the gym, but a lot of people aren't comfortable going back to the gym, so they are looking to build their own home gym. And in fact, whenever this pandemic started, you know, I think you couldn't find a pair of dumbbells in Walmart or anywhere else. They were all sold out. Everybody was starting their own home gyms. And I actually do wish I had this set of dumbbells last year. So let's take a look at it. So these are the dumbbells right here. And you can see that these are the power up set and it looks good. It's a good looking set. You can see here, if I put it down to the lowest one, so we're only looking at the handles. If you can see the handles, the handles are made out of a wooden type of finish. So this is definitely wood over here. And then everything else is plastic. This is plastic and there are this metal rails over here. So the good thing about this power up system is that it is adjustable. So you can go from 2.5 pounds all the way up to 15 pounds and it's pretty easy to do. So right there, right now I'm at 15 pounds. So I can lift it up and the weights do not fall off. So you see right there, the weights don't fall off and you can just adjust it to whatever you want. So you can adjust it to 7.5 pounds. You do have to make sure they're both at the same the same poundage over here. You don't want it to be uneven. So once you do that, you lift it up. You only have two of the weights attached to it on either side. So there you go. And it's just easy as that. There is this plastic base that it comes with. So there is a plastic base that you do need. You do need this base because this is what's going to keep all the little weights in its track. So when you put it on, it goes into the track and then you can adjust the weight to whatever weight you want over here. And it goes from 2.5 pounds all the way up to 50 pounds, like I said. All right, so that's basically the weights right here, 15 pounds. Uh, you know, they are comfortable. They don't shake around. They're not even uneven. They feel pretty well balanced in the air. Even if I do, you know, shoulder presses or whatever, it's a pretty good set of weights. And this is only 15 pounds. They do have a 25 pound set of dumbbells also, but this is more for your beginners. And this is also good for anybody. Like for me, for my shoulders, I don't want to work out too hard on my shoulders. Even 15 pounds is a little bit too, too heavy because the shoulder muscles aren't the hugest muscles there and the shoulder joint can get overworked. So I like to work out with light weights, probably, you know, 10 pounds to 15 pounds, even 7.5 pounds. The dumbbells work well. They do adjust pretty easily. So if you look over here, you could adjust it super easy. I had another set of dumbbells that were really difficult to adjust. Let me see if I could bring it on the table. So let me show, let me show you. I'm going to try to bring the other set of dumbbells that I have. All right, so this is the other set of dumbbells that I have that were adjustable. I got them at Academy and they were super hard to adjust. So what you would do is press it down and try to move it. But as you can see, these are really difficult to adjust. So that's one of the reasons why I never use them. Like I can't even move it. And I tried to fix them like there. You can see it moved a little bit. So there, that's moving, that's adjusting. But this, but it's super difficult to adjust. So that's why I have these, which goes up to 55 pounds, but I don't use them because they are just too hard to adjust. In fact, I actually broke the other one because I was trying to make it adjust easier. So yeah, like I said, you can see here, this is really easy to adjust. You just lift it up and they slide pretty effortlessly to whatever weight you want it. You have to put the five pounds over here and it's going to, work. Like I said, you have to put it right back in the track and you're good to go. So there's that. All right. I do want to talk about one thing on these weights that it is not true to the weight. So even though it says it's 15 pounds, I found that it wasn't completely accurate on my scale. I put it on my bathroom scale 
and it was a little bit less than 15 pounds. Actually, let's go ahead and put it on the scale right now. All right, guys, so you can see right here, the scale is being teared and it's at zero right now. And I'm gonna put this 15 pound weight on it to see how much it weighs. Right, right, right here. So it tells me it weighs 14.10.2 ounces. So that's about 5.8 ounces off from being completely 15 pounds. So yeah, it is a little bit off. It's not the true weight, but it still gets the job done. At least it's gonna be a little bit off on both sides equally. So it's not gonna be you know uneven because I did weigh them each separately and they do weigh the same weight, you know, a little bit off. A little bit less than 15 pounds on both of these weights. So that is one thing to count for that you aren't really lifting 15 pounds. All right guys, so who are these dumbbells for? Well, I think that these dumbbells are for those who are looking for adjustable weights. Uh, they do have a 15 pound variant and they also do make a 25 pound variant also. But for the 15 pounds, that's gonna be for your, you know, people who are trying to get into weightlifting who don't want really heavy weights. And 15 pounds is gonna be a good starter set. And I think that even if you do lift heavy weights, that 15 pounds is gonna be something that you're gonna find useful yourself because you don't always want to be lifting super heavy weight. 15 pounds, like I said, is gonna be great for your shoulders or some other accessories that you do at your house. All right, so how much does this cost? This will cost you about $179. And while that is expensive for 15 pound dumbbells, you also have a 2.5 pound dumbbells, the five pound dumbbells, 7.5 pound dumbbells, 10 pound dumbbells, 12.5 dumbbells, and 15 pound dumbbells times two. So that's a lot of weight that you're gonna have. It's also gonna save you space when you have this set of dumbbells compared to if you had six different dumbbells, which you would need to have all the weights that this thing will provide you with. So it does give you convenience and space saving ability I do think it is a little bit pricey, probably closer to 100 bucks would probably be where I would like it. All right, guys, so who is this for? It's gonna be for those who wanna start out lifting weights and 15 pounds isn't gonna to be too crazy heavy. It's also gonna be for those who wanna save space in their house and not have weights all over the place, so it's gonna save you space. So what are my pros and cons? I kinda of already said them. It is a space saver for sure. I do like the adjustability. You go from 2.5 pounds all the way up to 15 pounds. Gonna be great for those accessory movements, especially for someone like me. That's what I'm gonna use them for, for accessory movements because I generally do need heavier weights whenever I'm lifting. Third benefit is that it's a good system. It, it is super easy to adjust the weights. Like I said, I had the other weights. Those gave me issues every time I had to use them. This one just glides real easy if you wanna adjust the weight to whatever weight you want it from 2.5 to 15 pounds. Uh, what are my cons? I think the con is gonna be that price. $179.99 is a little bit pricey. I think that if you do do the conversion, which is gonna be about a pound of weight per dollar, it's gonna be about, let's see, let's actually do the conversion right now. So it's about 100 pounds of weight that you're gonna get, so that would cost you about 100 bucks to $110. So it is a little bit pricey, but for the convenience that it provides you, the space saving ability that it has, I guess that's why it costs a little bit more of a premium. So I do wish it was a little bit cheaper, probably 125 bucks would probably be a little bit better, but that's basically gonna be my only con, the price. It's a little bit up there. So what am I gonna give this as Goku Runner rating? I think I'm gonna give this a Goku Runner thumbs kind of like this. It would be a thumbs up if it was a little bit cheaper, but because of that price, $179, for dumbbells that only go from 2.5 to 15 pounds, that's gonna be a little bit pricey for me. Like I said, 125 bucks would probably be a little bit better. And I do have a discount code, so it will drop it down a little bit, but still, it's gonna be over 150 bucks. So yeah, at the end of the day, I am gonna give this a Goku Runner thumbs meh for me, but it is a good product. The only thing that I don't like about it is that price. All right guys, so that's gonna be it for the review of this Life Pro Power Up system. It is a great system, just a little bit pricey, and that's gonna be my review. All right guys, hope you guys enjoyed this. If you guys did, give me a like, subscribe to our channel, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace out.